The Bobcats looked to sweep Illinois, but the fighting Illini had other ideas. Leo D'Andrea fires a stretch pass to Kip Hoffman, passes it to the spot as Casper Reba snaps it home to bring them up 1-0. After Hoffman scored to make it 2-0, Brandon Hayes on a fire on left circle to beat Max Carlinzig, and the Illini have built a 3-0 lead. Ohio got a much needed goal under five minutes left in the first as Sam Turner slides one in front and Spencer Shones wrist shots one to the back of the net. Then later, Illinois added another to bring the score to 4-1. After Illinois went up 4-1, a Zamboni issue caused a delay of game for the third period. Then, after around 30 minutes of discussion, they decided to suspend the game and we'll finish it up at a later date. Yeah, I mean, it's out of our control, obviously. Something happened to the Zamboni and then you're just gonna wait and see if they can fix it and they couldn't and at this point it's not safe for both teams and the referees to be on the ice so I think it's the right decision to stop it and, and resume at a later date. The hope is that the ACHA commissioner will allow the third period to be played at a later date but as of right now it is currently pending. The Bobcats will play a home and home game versus Adrian College. Puck drop Thursday at 7.30 and 7 p.m. Friday. For Bobcat Showcase, I'm Tanner Watts.